Hello everyone. My name is Anik Khatana and I am a practicing high court lawyer. Currently I am working as a state counsel in Advocate General Office Islamabad. So in this video I am going to tell you that how can you work in Islamabad or Karachi or Punjab or any other advocate general office in Pakistan and how is that going to help you in your legal career. But before I do that I would request you to kindly like this video, subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. When you start practicing in Pakistan there are two questions which comes to anyone's mind. First is that how you are going to learn how you are going to serve your client and second is that how you are going to earn for yourself, how are you going to meet your bread and butter. So these two questions are very important. And in order to explore these questions, people like me, they go to different institutions and then they try to grab the opportunity that they are available in the market, in the legal market. So in my opinion, if you are still studying or if you are going to university, if you are in your final year, I think you must go to Advocate General Office and request them and file an application for an internship. Because if you would like to have an internship in the Advocate General Office, you cannot have it without the permission of the Advocate General. And let's suppose if the Advocate General is busy and he is unable to give you any time or space, then I would advise that you go to Assistant Advocate Journals and request them that if there is any research that you can conduct for them. If they are able to give you space, then you will be able to understand that how the state is representing the legal work before the honorable courts. But if you still do not get a chance to work with any assistant advocate journal in any of the provinces, then you can request the state councils. I am working as a state council in the Islamabad Advocate Journal office. I am appointed to appear before uh, Division Bench 3 uh, in Islamabad. So this is how you can request the state councils that we can assist you with your research and we can we can assist you in drafting your uh, appeals or anything. I personally believe when you join any law firm, you join the law firm with the intention that you are going to learn from this firm because any XYZ firm would have a lot of cases and then you would be able to research on it and then you would be able to appear for those cases. But Advocate General Office or Attorney General Pakistan's office has a lot of cases on daily basis. So the amount of work that you are going to get from these offices, you can never get that amount of work from any law firm. So rather than going to any law firm, I would suggest that you start your practice with the Advocate General Office. Mostly they deal with the criminal appeals, they deal with the constitutional matters and wherever the AG office is involved, you will have to go and represent the AG office and the state. So state means the province that you are representing at that time. So let's suppose if I am working in Islamabad, I will have to represent the AG office and the state of, uh, and the government of ICT, Islamabad Capital Territory. By going to that uh, office, you will be able to understand that the how staff is working, how cases are marked, how cause lists are being made, how advocate journal is conducting his own research, how assistants are uh, assistant advocate journals are appearing, and how they are pleading their arguments. Because when you go to the court, your timing would be from 9 to nine to 2 o'clock or maybe 3 o'clock. But if you go to a law firm, your timing might be from 9 to 5 or maybe 9 to 10 o'clock. It depends on your boss. But in official in government offices, the official time is 9 to 2 or maybe 3 o'clock. And even between that, there is a break time. During that break time, you can go to the bar room where you can meet a lot of lawyers and build up your legal network. Because when you stop working at AG office and you go out of this circle, you will be able to work in a law firm and you will be able to work in different area of laws. And this network and these people that you have already met in the bar rooms are going to help you to offer a space for you in their law firm. So if you would like to work in AG office, the very simple task is that you have to go to the relevant advocate journal. You have to request him because you are still working or maybe you are going to your school. So you will have to go to Advocate Journal office maybe two or three times to remind him that I'm very much interested to work in this office. This is how he's going to make a space for you. And if he is busy, then you can go to uh, Assistant Advocate Journal and you can also go to State Council. It is not important that you only get your certificate or experience letter from such people, but it is important that you really literally work with them. So if you want to work with them, don't waste your time, go to Advocate Journal office, 
uh, start your career because trust me if you start working today maybe you become the uh, future advocate journal and you can only become one advocate journal of any territory once you know that how do you have to operate how you have to run the system of your uh, advocate journal of the second question which came into my mind and which also comes in everybody's mind that how i'm going to earn once you understand that how you deal with the bail applications and how you deal with the writ petitions uh, by representing the ag office uh, side by side you will also be able to know that how do you have to assist assist your clients in bail application because in the beginning of your career you are going to get minor bails up bail application and you you will be able to plead that before the honorable court so if you are able to plead that before the honorable court by learning it from the ag office this is the area where you are going to earn money for yourself so i uh, uh, once again i wish you good luck for uh, practicing in pakistan and you must work in ag office this is going to broaden your experience and horizon and if you face any problem and if you are working in islamabad uh, you can always contact me you can find my number on my youtube channel and i will try to help you as much as i can thank you very much for watching my video i'll see you another vlog take care bye bye